the current royalty rates for oil sands are appropriate and we will maintain those rates as a result and adopt a new framework for assessing deductible costs with greater transparency, accountability and certainty. I, I think that this allows people to know into the future what, uh, what Alberta's royalty system will look like and at the end of the 60 days we'll have the ability to actually do the math uh, very directly. And uh, companies do look at uh, jurisdictions and it's not just within Canada, it's uh, globally many times. And uh, now having this announcement out and uh, the direction we got today will allow companies to have more certainty when they're making those decisions. Our current royalty scheme is fair. Uh, and you know, if, they, if the government can use this as an opportunity now to help continue to inform Albertans of how we as Albertans, as owners of the resource, benefit from our oil and gas uh, resources, well that's a good thing. I think what this proved today is that what we've been saying all along is that the, uh, the royalty review was unnecessary. Uh, that what this government has done is, is cost Albertans thousands if not hundreds of thousands of jobs, billions of dollars of investment, uh, by having an unnecessary royalty regime uh, review that at the end of the day has uh, said what we've got now is pretty good. Uh, and meanwhile, the investment is already gone. The jobs are already gone. The damage that they've done is immeasurable. Uh, and today, the government has pretty much uh, admitted that with the conclusions that they have announced today.